the children's plan has made us look at the way we personalise the learning experiences and, and the wider experiences for every child. And I think it's made us very focused on the fact that we can't deliver um, the range of experiences and services to every child on our own and that we have to develop relationships with other organisations and other providers to be able to do that. Outside of the classroom there are lots of activities that are on offer and they do concerts several times a year. Um, sporting activities, there are, there are an awful lot of clubs, hockey, netball, football, anything really. The things I like most about the schools, like my clubs that I go to with my friends on the lunch time. We have community clubs that come and use the facilities, we have um, a lot of the public come and use the gym facilities. We have a lot of adult learning here, um, it's, it's just a hub of the community really. Our connections with the wider community are very, very strong indeed. We need to identify the needs of students early, um, especially SEN, children who are looked after or children in vulnerable groups. And we work very closely with our multi-agency partners on this. One thing that we do do for uh, students with uh, special educational needs is a social skills group which is a formal programme which runs once a week, uh, follows a certain structure which deals with the issues that's, uh, that are involved with those students, particularly behaviour issues and self-esteem issues. The school actually gives the children such confidence and there's so many things that the children get involved in. All of my children are part of extracurricular clubs and they benefit um, by uh, having an extra outlet, not just an academic outlet, it creates a more rounded student. Yeah.